if if you happen to lose in the party election, is there a plan B for you? Um, do you intend to run for parliament again uh, in the next GE? Or will you, um, you know, if, if it doesn't work out, are you going to leave politics again? I, I, I think there's, 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 um, um, it's quite obvious that, you know, if we were to appeal to the fan sitters again, I have to run for parliament again, you know. Um, so in that sense, you know, whether I win deputy president or not is almost secondary, to be frank, because um, the focus is a lot bigger than that. The focus is to make sure that we remain relevant. And, um, and the focus has always been about the public. It's not really about, um, you know, the party positions. I've been able to give my opinions, even if I didn't have any senior party positions anyway, you know. But I understand as well that the public expects, you know, certain MPs, the public expect a bit more activism in the parliament. So definitely, you know, um, um, if I'm given a chance, I will run for MP again. Um, so on that basis, you know, um, regardless of the outcome of the party election, uh, things are very different than 2018. In 2018, um, I was a member of the public, just like you guys. You know, I was not an MP. Um, I, you know, um, in terms of party position, um, the party decided that I should not sit in PH Presidential Council or any decision making because that, you know, for fear of upsetting Tun Mahathir. Um, so in, in that sense, you know, I... I was clipped. I, you know, I, I didn't have much room to maneuver politically. If anything, I do beyond that is almost being. It will be. It would have been seen as being a troublemaker, which I fully respected the need at that time to you know find a balance between stability and and you know dissenting voice. Things will be most probably different this time around because um, PH and PKR um, are a lot weaker. We don't actually know how many MPs we will have in the next parliament. Um, so if my brand of you know, activism in parliament is required, uh, that's something that I hope we can focus as well beyond just the context for the deputy presidency of the party. If you get a chance to contest in the next GE again, which parliamentary seat would you... I think that has to be left to the party. Yeah, I think it's jumping the gun now. I mean, that's a prerogative of the party, and the party will decide. But I think the party is also fully aware that um, in all likelihood, um, um, I would offer myself um, to stand again for parliament.